Yo, what's up guys? This is Boshi. Today I want to show you guys how to create a clear stop motion video by applying layer mask in Photoshop. Okay guys, let me show you uh, the final image first. The pizza! my personal opinion, I feel like stop motion videos are more suitable for uh, fast food. For example, pizza, burgers, sandwiches, donuts. And if you only want to create a simple stop motion video like this, I think Asian food is not really suitable. Uh, because you can image what you're going to do with uh, a bowl of combination fried rice, a plate of sweet and salt pork, pad thai, Korea cold noodle, even uh, Japanese curry. I'm hungry. All right, let's jump into Photoshop and get started. All right, guys, now we are in Photoshop. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to load all the images into the same layer tape. And we go to File, we go to Scripts, Load Files into Stack. We're gonna choose all the photos that I shot for the pizza, but not this one. Press open. Okay. And the Photoshop gonna open all the photos into the same layer for us. This may take uh, 10 seconds, really depends on your computer. Okay, now we got all the photos here. And the next, the next step I'm going to do is I'm gonna select all the photos and I'm going to uh, resize the photos because uh, we only use the stop motion video in uh, in Instagram and uh, and Facebook, so we don't need that huge resolution. So in this case, uh, I'm going to resize to twelve thousand. You can resize to any size you want, but yeah, it doesn't really matter. And I'm gonna leave the resolution to three hundred. Before you go to next step, you will need to make sure your timeline is here. But if you can't find your timeline in your Photoshop, you will need to go to Window, and you can find your timeline right here. So we're just gonna create a frame animation, and then we go to the nice icon, little icon here, and we go to a uh, frame make frames from layers. Now we got twelve layers in the same timeline. But the order is not right, so we go to the icon again, and we're gonna choose reverse frames. Now we got the correct order for the for the pizza, and the next step I'm going to do is I'm going to select all the layers in the timeline, and I'm gonna change to 0.2 second because I feel like 0.2 second is the um, it works really well in stop motion video because I feel like 0.1 seconds is, is too fast and 0.5 is too slow but this is really depends on personal taste okay 0.2 but I'm going to change the last one to 0.5 because I would like some uh, little bit gap between the, the stop motion video restart again so we're gonna change the once to forever and press play as you can see we're, we, we already got a really good stop motion here but the problem is, I shot these photos um, with ambient light, natural light, so and we move the movie tiki by accident. So we want to make it perfect. So the only movement in this in this stop motion video should be the pizza. So I'm gonna apply a layer mask on all the layers except my background layer. So I'm gonna go into uh, this layer here, and I'm gonna. Because there is a really already a strong contrast between the background and the white plate, so I'm just gonna use quick selection tool to select the white plate back, uh, white plate, and apply a layer mask on it. As you can see, layer mask block all the background, but we want to say background, right? So we will need to make sure the background layer is visible in the layer 11 here. And for layer 10, we need to do the same thing. I'm going to copy, press o Option, 
and drag the layer mask to this layer and visible our background layer. So we're going to do the same thing on the number 9. Drag visible number 8. Same thing again. We're going to drag the layer mask and we're going to visible the background layer. Number 7. Same thing again. Number six, same thing again. Number five, again. Number four, one more time. Number three, we're almost there. Number two, and number one layer. Oops. Okay, now um, the problem is in this layer, you can see we're missing the handle. So to fix that is really simple. We just choose the layer mask here and press B for brush and make sure your foreground color is white, pure white. And now I'm going to brush the handle here to get the handle back and make sure your opacity is uh, is hundred percent. All right. And now if we press play again, you can see we got really clear stop motion video. And the next step, I'm going to export it. Export, save for web. You can save to anywhere you want, uh, and make sure your uh, your format is GIF. And save. I'm just gonna save to a uh, desktop. I'm gonna re rename to pizza. Press save. And now you got the clear stop motion video. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave me a comment and see you next time. Peace. Pizza sucks without you. Every day is a fall without you. Pizza sucks without you. Every day is a fall without you. Pizza sucks without you. Every day is a song.